Hi, this is Jeff Challen. In this screencast, I want to show you how to address one of the common problems you have getting started on MP4. Android Studio is a little bit different than IntelliJ when you run the test suites. And so I want to show you how you can determine what's going on. And I also want to show you uh, a small change that you can make to your project that will uh, make it a little bit easier to get going. So I've got the MP4 starter code right here. And you know I'm going to go up here and I'm going to find this uh, test uh, tab that you would normally run. And this is an error that a lot of people have been seeing and have been confused about, where I see this cannot find uh, class in class path. Um, and it gives you the name of the, the class it's looking for. The reason this is happening is that the class is not compiling. And so when the class doesn't compile, it doesn't get moved into the right location where the test suite can find it. But this error is confusing. Let me show you one really important thing that you need to realize, which is that when you run the test suite, there's actually two tabs that get opened here in the run configuration. And I understand this is, again, a little bit different uh, than it was in the four was before but here's a tab that shows you what happened when it tried to build and then here's a tab that, that shows you the results from the test suite and so if you just look at this it can be very difficult to figure out what went wrong but we, if we go over here um, we get more information so what this says is that um, i tried to run check style and there was a violation found and um, this will Let's see, it, it doesn't look like it actually tells you, oh no, here it is. So I'm missing a java.com comment and RGBA pixel. And so this gives me a sense of, of what I need to do to fix this. I'm gonna go over here. Um, it tells me what line it's on. I'll put in a um, java.com comment for this. Oops, there we go. And then I can try running the test suite again. And so every time this happens, when it, when it finishes the test suite, it, it's gonna open up this test tab. And so, Again, I see the same error, uh, but if I go over here and look at the build tab, now what I'm gonna see is that there's all these errors in my transform.job, and that's because I haven't created this file yet. And so I need to go through and I need to start implementing these methods, actually creating them, um, stubbing them out at least, so that the, the test suite can compile. So unfortunately, and this is our fault, but um, we've configured this MP to fail the build entirely if there's a check style error. So if there's a check style error anywhere in your code, uh, it actually won't uh, build the rest of it, and it will just stop right there. And that may not be what you want. So let me show you how to change that if you want. And this won't affect testing, it doesn't affect grading. So the grader doesn't do this. The grader um, will give you 10 points for check style if you have no errors, and zero if you don't, but it won't fail entirely if, if you have any check style errors. This is only when you're building um, and, and working and running the test suites. So, to fix this, what we need to do is we need to go over um, to our project view. We need to go into the lib directory. We need to open up the build.gradle file here. And under the check style configuration section, we need to uh, add this line, ignore failures is equal to true. We can sync the project. This should work. OK. And now what's going to happen, so, so let me show you uh, what that changes. Again, this is totally safe to do. It's up to you uh, whether or not you do this this way. If you don't do it, just keep in mind that any check style problems in RGBA pixel or transform test.java warnings will cause the, the test suite to fail. Uh, but if you want to be able to continue run the, running the test suites, even if you have some check style issues, this is what you need to do. And again, we, we should have shipped the MP this way, but this is a small change to make. All right, so um, I'm going to go over here. I'm going to peel off uh, this, so I'll create another check style problem. I can see that I have a check style error here. It's telling me I'm missing a Java comment. Let me run the test suites, though. And again, the test suite's still going to fail because I haven't created transform.java uh, yet, and so that class doesn't exist. Um, but we can see all the compilation errors that I didn't see before. There's still a check style problem here as well, but the build isn't failing just because there's that check style error. I'm going to make this change to the starter code today, and so if you uh, clone the MP, you know from this point on you will have this fix already. So if you open up um, your your build.gradle file and you already see that ignore failures is true, just leave it alone. Um, I'll, I'll make this fix for for anybody who still hasn't started the MP. Please do start the MP. Um, but this is this will sh this shows you sort of how to fix this if um, you're struggling with this error. And it also shows you how to get more information about what's going wrong. So just looking at this 
output from the test suite is not very helpful. You have to go over here, switch to this tab, and this will tell you um, exactly what's going wrong.